A rectangular swimming pool has a length of 11 feet, a width of 16 feet, and a depth of 5 feet. How many cubic feet of water can the pool hold? To begin, a swimming pool is a large box or right rectangular prism, and therefore the volume is equal to the length times the width times the height. So for this first question, we are assuming we fill the pool all the way to the top, and therefore the volume is equal to 11 feet times 16 feet times 5 feet. Notice how this gives us the units of cubic feet and 11 times 16 times 5 is 880 and therefore the volume is 880 cubic feet. Next, the manufacturer suggests filling the pool to 95 percent capacity. How many cubic feet of water is this? To answer this question, we need to find 95% of 880 cubic feet. To find the percent of a number, we convert the percent to a decimal and multiply. And therefore, to find 95% of 880 cubic feet, we need to find the product of 0 0.95, which is the decimal for 95%, times 880 cubic feet. 0 0.95 times 880 is equal to 836 giving us 836 cubic feet. So if the pool is filled to 95% capacity, there will be 836 cubic feet of water in the pool. Next, one cubic foot of water is approximately 7.48 gallons. How many gallons of water should you put in the pool at 95% capacity? To answer this question, we need to figure out how many gallons there are in 836 cubic feet, because this is the amount of water in the pool at 95% capacity. So let's begin with 836 cubic feet as a fraction with the denominator of 1. And now we'll multiply by a unit fraction using the conversion 1 cubic foot is approximately 7.48 gallons. For the unit fraction, because we have cubic feet in the numerator here, we need to have cubic feet in the denominator of the unit fraction so that the units of cubic feet will simplify out leaving us with gallons. So we have gallons in the numerator and cubic feet in the denominator. And since one cubic foot is approximately 7.48 gallons, the unit fraction is 7.48 gallons over one cubic foot. Cubic feet divided by cubic feet simplify out, leaving us with the units of gallons. So the number of gallons is 836 times 7.48 which is 6,253.28. So at 95% capacity, the pool will hold six, approximately 6,253.28 gallons of water. And for the last question, a gallon of water weighs approximately 8.35 pounds. How many pounds of water are in the pool at 95% capacity? So we know at 95% capacity, we have this number of gallons of water. We need to convert this into pounds using the conversion provided. Let's begin with 6,253.28 gallons as a fraction with a denominator of one. And now I multiply by unit fraction using the conversion. One gallon weighs approximately 8.35 pounds. We want gallons to simplify out, which means we have to have gallons in the denominator and pounds in the numerator. And since one gallon is approximately 8.35 pounds, the unit fraction is 8.35 pounds over one gallon. We have gallons divided by gallons, gallons simplify out, and now we're left with pounds. Going back to the calculator, we have 6,253.28 times 8.35, enter, Running to the hundredths place value or two decimal places, we have approximately 52,214.89 pounds. I hope you found this helpful.